Time is getting closer to find out who will be joining us right here on your Feel Good Breakfast Show. So make sure you stick with us and don't miss a step of that exciting journey. Right now, though, if you're looking for something to do maybe this weekend, and if you're in Joburg looking for something fun, why not visit the International Marimba and Steel Pan Festival that's happening at the St. Dominic School in Boxburg, and that's not tomorrow and also on Sunday. Now, Chola was lucky enough to catch up with a marimba band from Carter Primary School in Alexandra that will be competing in the festival, but it sure sounds like a whole lot of fun going into this weekend. This weekend we'll see the 7th annual International Marimba and Steel Pan Festival bring together 2,000 performers from across the African continent. 250 performances will take place between Saturday and Sunday and the event will also pay tribute to former President Nelson Mandela. <laughs> Joan, tell me when and how did this festival come about? Well, in 2012, I started the festival. Um, I had done six national marimba festivals and felt that I needed to go international and uh, education Africa was way behind me. And so we, that's what happened. What can people expect to experience come the weekend? People can expect to experience um, marimba bands playing non-stop for two whole days. Uh, people can come to watch and take part in 90 workshops in the fringe events. Tell me about the Pinky Band that we've been so privileged to hear perform today. Pinky Band is an amazing band. I took them on an overseas trip to the UK. They have an inspiring teacher who works with them non-stop and you can see the results of, of what they've done. They're, they're one of our top bands in the Gauteng area. With me is Mukhari, who's responsible for grooming all these young Maruma players and it must be such a pleasant experience grooming such young talent. How is it like, Mukhari? So wonderful and the first time that I taught these children, it was so nice. We cannot wait to go to the festival because we know that we are going to meet all these ethnic groups, all the people who are going to show us their talents and we are going to show them our talents and then we are going to show them that Pinky Band rocks. I started playing marimba in 2016 when I was doing grade 6. I enjoyed seeing uh, children from a township playing music, so I also wanted to prove it to other people that children from township like us can also play music like children from academic house schools. When I first saw it, I was like impressed because it was my first time seeing this amazing instrument. When I started seeing marimba and seeing other learners doing it, I, t I started having an interest. At first I was scared, but because of I knew some people there, I started being confident and playing marimba and we went to the festival. You'll also be honouring the late President Nelson Mandela at this year's festival. How exactly will you be doing so? Well, I've written a piece of music for the massed marimba and steel pan item, which takes place at quarter past one on Saturday afternoon. A piece of music is called uh, Mandela Speaks, and it is about his quotes about music. And we'll have all the marimbas and steel pan players on the floor learning a brand new piece of music in 40 minutes. And we'll also have a whole djembe ensemble join us. How do people go about getting tickets to the event? So they can come directly to the gate at St. Dominic School in Boxburg in Kruger Street. And the tickets are 200 Rand for the whole weekend for a full weekend passport, which allows you to attend all the workshops you wish to do, as well as seeing all the amazing performances. As the festival director, what are you looking most forward to this year? I'm looking forward to that spirit of Ubuntu. You have to be there to understand what that's all about. It's not about the competitions, it's not about anything, it's about South African children getting together and making music together and showing the world and showing South Africa what South Africa could really be like in a truly democratic country. I must say I'm really blown away by the level of talent I've got to experience here today. So many young stars in the making. And if you want to experience this and more at the festival this Saturday and Sunday, don't forget to get your tickets. Let's all share in the spirit of beautiful marimba music.